This is Marley Park Phase 4. Yeah. Well, we went and looked at these houses Yeah. Before. So, Marley Park HOA is higher than um, some of those nearby areas that are not in Marley Park. But this is all the uh, new build. This is a Phase 4. Um, last night I came here. I forgot the builder. But... The nice thing about Marty Park, they have a community swimming pool. They have a lot more amenity, but you have to. But the, the downside is you have to pay a lot more at HOA. How much more? Uh, I don't know. I had to check. Uh, what did they say the HOA was there? This one here, the one I just looked that is not in Marley Park, but it's just nearby. They're paying fifty, sixty nines a month. Yeah, so they're paying a hundred ten. Yeah, so this one probably is over a hundred. But you know, for a community amenity, all that stuff, I think is probably around less than 120. So it's about double. Some people would might consider it expensive. So you can see the there are a lot of new home. Uh, I kind of can see the backyard and everything is kind of small lot right here. And yeah. But there's a uh, older part of the Marley part of very nice too. They have a lot of green and in which we will go there and show so here is really nice here. Yeah, so. And these back right up to the school. Yeah. So there's a uh, one of the Liberty schools. Mm-hmm. Or independent schools. They, I think it's Legacy. Legacy, I think. Mean, That's yes, right. Legacy. The Legacy uh, Charter School is within the Marley Park. It's right there. That's right. The builder's called Tom. T O W N E. So you can see there's a lot of homes mm -hmm. right next to the school. Yeah, and I think the price range is from I I can't recall, but last time I see is I think it's maybe around six hundred. They say it's a four hundred, but um, after you get. Uh, can't get it for four. Lot premium and uh, the standard thing any, that you have to add, to any upgrade. Uh, it's probably you need to make a 10 to 15 percent uh, on the listed price in order to give you a true, mm -hmm. true more closer estimate. So this is the older part of Marley Park. Street, sort of like a Disney like <laughs> community. I, I like to put it that way. Very nice and tidy and clean. Uh, this one, a little bit like that. They have some prairie style houses, mm -hmm. those look very nice. Mm -hmm. and each house kind of have their own little 
Disney style. Yeah, it's some Spanish style, mm -hmm. prairie style, mission style. Right. And that's why there are a lot of people like um, Marley Park and Surprise because that. See. Yeah, this is a well done. Mm hmm. There's kids because they got the turkey and mm -hmm. stuff. <laughs> the Halloween stuff still still there. And then here's their their park, community Jeez. park. So it's really pretty. This is a nice neighborhood. Mm -hmm. Too many for sale signs. Uh, no, I'll look at this one here. That's nice. Yeah, this one's more like a Breakfast Spanish style, like around. reminding me California. Some of them reminding me of Portland, Oregon style. <laughs> you see it in all different. In a Verado, in uh, Buckeyes, also similar like that. Has a lot of tree, beautiful, small little community. Oh. oh, I just see somebody have garage sale. There's another park. You can see. show the difference between mature trees and, yeah. and uh, new build with no trees yeah. and what you can expect the community to look like yeah. 10 years after. Exactly. So that's why I always prefer an older neighborhood because you can see what it's like. See? Look at this beautiful bougainvilleas here. Oh, I love those red. Uh -huh. Look at that. Oh, here's another park on my left. I just missed it. We do a lot of good green space. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Here's another park. They have a lot of parks for sure. Oh, this Green is nice space. Look at how shady it is. Yeah. Right? So you yeah. have good, good that. shade on it. Look at this house here. Wow. Where am I in California? <laughs> look at that. See how much shade there's surrounding this Marley Park area? It's just beautiful. Definitely, I'm an older neighborhood kind of girl, so. Wow. So there's the community center. Yeah, right there. That's a nice little community center. Mm-hmm. Got ball fields and stuff. There's another little community center right there. Mm-hmm. Wow. They did a really, really, really good job here. It's nice. And look at this. It's just beautiful. So this, 
this area, I think it's different than like Goodyear, right? In the uh, Estrella Parkway. Estrella Parkway gives you a lot of desert scenery. This one is like a small family community kind of scenery. It's very different. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see how this community fares if water becomes a problem. Yeah, because there's a lot, because of, lawns, a lot of green a lot now. And I know like uh, Glendale's right now, they already changed their law for their water usage. So in, so they, they don't want you to uh, use a lot of water for your grass. And then surprise here, a lot of greens here. So that would be interesting to see how the city is going to handle the water usage. They do what Las Vegas does. Be well, Las Vegas is already starting to uh, ask everybody to not use real grass anymore. So they're going to have some problems. Yeah. Some 